Alright, so, after a little break, after the torment that was that last, uh, that last, uh, club race, move on to our next tournament in the golden year of 1982. It's time for the 944 Cup, limited to 944s only. In 1982, Porsche introduced a new model, the 944. This lengthy tournament features his new, or this new smooth handling car, a vast variety of driving conditions. Ooh. So yeah, five races, and uh, nine in the new 944, $10,000 entry fee, damn, for a $50,000 prize. Good thing I have a lot of money from all those failed attempts at uh, all the other shit I've been doing in this era. So, let's see what we got here. We have one whole ass 944 to choose from, and it's the 1982 Coupe. I wonder if there's any used ones. There's probably not any used ones. <clears throat> at least, not yet. And the answer is no. In fact, there's not a single used uh, Golden Era car right now in the dealership. All right. So, 944, here it is in all of its glory. Um, I have absolutely no idea what color I want this to be. I'm thinking that maroon. Let's do maroon, yeah. Yeah, sure, that'll work take that. Imagine not getting the turbo. I mean, I don't have the turbo as a purchase option right now, so <laughs> uh, I'm gonna buy this. And uh, we're gonna do our usual shit. It would help if I actually, you know, selected the correct car. That, that would help out a lot, actually. Here's our non full full coupe. The shiny rims. Fucking shining. Alright, do that. Yeah, let's put some stripes on this thing, why not? Yeah, sure. I like how the number goes on the uh, rear panel. Sure, that'll work. That, that works. That looks good to me. I'm, I'm fine with that. I am fine with that. Yeah, stripes give it more power. Speaking of more power, let's see what we got here in the uh, the parts catalog here for we got for what we got here. So we got throttle body, flywheel, all our usual stuff. Ooh, supercharger! Hello. Okay. Supercharge it. Uh, box. We can get some bumpers, fiberglass. Hmm. All right. <clears throat> well, because I know how this game is going to go, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, upgrade the fuck out of this thing. And if I need to downgrade it, honestly, downgrading will be a lot easier than upgrading. Is there any other uh, air filter upgrade? No. Okay. Do that. Typically, add five to ten horsepower. We can get a different ECU. This place a standard engine management computer chip, one that increases car's power by adjusting engine's air fuel ratio. We're getting some fancy stuff here. The computers and stuff. Uh, cold air intake. 15 25 horsepower. Hell, ooh, high butterfly intake. It costs more, therefore, it's better. Yeah, a little bit better. Let's do that. Let's do high performance exhaust. Another 20 to 35 horsepower. I kind of want to hold off on these supercharger uh, upgrades for now. Let's see, what's the stage 4 get? Route rev rate, half power ground, very depending. 100 to 120 horsepower. You know what, let's get, um, let's get stage two. How about stage two? So, 60 to 80 horsepower gain. Let's, let's do that, stage two supercharger. If I need more, well, we got, we got two stages to go, so. Alright, let's get the professional brakes. Let's get the, uh, quick shift, hello. Quick shift or decreases time between gear changes. Ooh, okay. Do that. We'll get the close ratio gearbox. That seems to be very effective. Get the racing springs, racing shocks. 
fiberglass panels. Um, I don't know if I want to get any of the bumpers. I think I want to. I'll, I'll just leave it the way it is. Extra stiff sway bar. Extra. Stiffest sway bar available. Practically eliminates body roll. Stress on tires is increased substantially. Oh, okay. Uh, it said varying conditions, so I'm kind of tempted to get both rain tires and slicks. Although I'm not. I don't think I will be able to know what the conditions actually are going to be. And rims. I'm just gonna leave the stock rims on it. So there we go. For a grand total of fifteen thousand dollars. Out of my 291,000, boom, there we go. Or no balls, balls eight. <laughs> oh, whoops, wrong thing. All right, so let's just uh, install these upgrades now. One by one. Intake, exhaust. Soup charge it. Brakes on there. Get the quick shifter with the close ratio gearbox. And the last and springs, the last and shocks. This mouse sensitivity is fucking annoying. Wish I could lower it, but just have to make do with this. Put the slicks on. Apparently we have Style 3 rims installed, okay. Oh wow, alright. Look at that. Yeah. So there's our 944, ready to go, I hope. So, five races here in the 944 Cup. Again, I'm not sure if there's a way to, uh... Tell what the weather condition is gonna be like. I mean, I guess we could do a practice run, but... <laughs> nah. Let's just go. Here we go. Okay, it's dry. We're good. <laughs> no rain yet. Three, two, one, go! So who's 944 is best 944? We're about to find out. Yep, don't go that way. That way is slower. Oh, ball. <laughs> Use me, pardon me, come through. Going fast ish. We are carrying some amount of speed. This is a class 3 car, so it's not going to be as quick as what we've been driving, especially in the. Uh, in terms of the golden era cars. The engine is fairly quiet as well. Kills me. Got my waste deal. Ruined my uh, safe bonus. <clears throat> How dare you. Also, it's amazing looking out of looking out of the back of a Porsche that actually has a different rear end for once. Since the uh, 356 and the 911 have pretty much the same ass. <clears throat> FCR except in some ways. I can see it. Also, I do feel like I'm carrying a good amount of speed. I know the sense of speed in this game isn't the greatest, but... This, this seems believable for 110 miles per hour. This looks like I made the right choice in terms of supercharger. I'm pretty even with Dylan here. Track is aggressively 2000, yeah. Dwayne! 
Yeah, a little bit of cam, also high cam, I just noticed you were here. I'm a good streamer, yes. Remember kids, Lewis Hamilton plays with Chase Cam with a wheel. Therefore it's okay. It is him. The Cam. Oh, that was a... Pretty fun race. I'll see surprise it is. You though. won the race. I was, I was, ex I was honestly expecting like, okay, I didn't go for the top supercharger, which means I'm gonna get my fucking ass ruined. But nope, it didn't happen. What's up? <coughs> Excuse me. How's it going? You're the tournament leader. Damn straight on the tournament. I'm gonna win this tournament as well. Cool beans. Hey, look at that! A not, the only not 911 in the uh, board for this track. Wow, that's crazy. So now that I have, I'm going to be starting on pole. I'm, this will probably be a lot easier. Well, 1,300 for repairs for very minimal repairs. So we're getting into the expensive range, definitely. So let's go to Zone Industrial. Replay is loud. Yeah. It's fairly loud. At least at the start. There right, we go. Three. Race two, zone two, industrial. One. Go! <clears throat> Away we go. That might have been a bit of a short shift, I don't know. Can't tell what the frickin' rev limit is. Alright, looks like it's about 6,500. Okay. I keep like wanting to rev it to the red line, but that's obviously not where I need to rev it to, because the limit kicks in before then. Slowing me down. Oh! Oh, God! Still ping-ponging off the walls. <laughs> oh, wow, that did a lot of damage. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, this race just going from bad to worse. Good God. A lot of bad things happening here. I got a lot of damage. And unfortunately, a lot of it's in the drivetrain as well, which is going to slow me way the fuck down. What was this horizon? Oh, my God. Ah, yes, drive tar is my favorite. This way. I almost went right again, but this is slightly faster because the turns aren't as tight. <laughs> so, yeah. Probably because he fucking destroyed it while hitting one of the walls. And, hey, look, Dylan and uh, Paris are losing out, going, taking the left path, which is slower, apparently. Oh, wow, Dylan really lost out. It's in the sixth. Two paths converge. Leadfoot's in second. Paris is in third. I think Dylan might have been, uh, crashed at some point. <clears throat> oh, it works for me. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's definitely going to help out in points, that's for sure. Yeah, that's why the car is very silent, because it's a front engine, <laughs> unlike the other cars, which are rear engine. Can't hear shit from back here. Okay, with a 944 added to heat as DLC. Trains. Ooh. Oh, oh, okay. I think I hit the wall there. Not sure. Got the ween. By quite a lot. 
I like how this is just, oh my god. Barely hit the wall there in the finish, and it gave me another fucking 13 You've won the race! Game. Good god. Alright. I don't know this. Just... Oh my 20 seconds, though. You're the tournament leader! Yeah. By three points now over Paris. Dylan's one point back. So I got the advantage. <laughs> Imagine if all DLCs are free like GT Sport. Gaming would be in a lot better place right now. $6,000 for repairs. That's fair, considering how battered the car was. All right, so next race, Monte Carlo, circuit three. We'll do it to it. Three, two, one, go! That's like 14, four, three, seven. Uh, he probably got a safe, the safe bonus from race one. If if uh, if you finish the race without taking any damage, you get a safe bonus. It's sometimes a weird amount of money. Very specific. <laughs> this might be one of those cases. So like how much smoother this uh, this term is going compared to the last the uh, freaking Euro Rally that I just did. It's like, ah. <laughs> this is what actually being able to win this feels like. Of course, this is a one-make series, so... There's only one 944, at least for now. So we're all in the same thing, just with different amounts of upgrades. <clears throat> Maybe the same amount of upgrades, I don't know. <clears throat> Excuse me. AI seem fairly even, to be honest. That's your first lap. You're in first place. Blue. This is your final lap. Smooth. I know this is just a street circuit, just a street track that loops and also has some curves, but the track is a nice change of pace from the freaking rural point to point tracks, which makes up the rest of the game. It's not quite on the same, you know, same level as the just actual, like, permanent street or permanent race circuits that were in a high stakes, but this is still nice. Plus, you know, it's Monaco. It's a street course in real life, so hey. Yeah, I wonder if we can see Jimmy Broadbent. He's in Monaco right now. So is Super GT. Alright, I'm gonna slow down here so I don't go careening into the wall of the finish. There we go. There we go. You won Watch the race! Was there too, of all people? Fucking Leo the EA shill. Anyways, I win. You're the tournament leader. Yeah. Sweet, I got the safe bonus. 1750. Close. And fourth best lap time. Second best, personally. So that's cool. Ah. 
That's that's really interesting. All right, so that means no repairs need done. So no more money out of my pocket. Let's just go on to race four at Corsica and continue this fairly dominant run here. F for Frog. Oh yeah, I heard what happened. Apparently Frog is like a controversial. What the fuck? Three. Corsica's two, having some loading one, issues. Go. All of a sudden. I don't know what the hell's going on here. <clears throat> Anyways, I've heard... I don't know if it's just the small, like, the two people that I'm exposed to who actually care about uh, GT Sport, eSports, but apparently, um... Frog is a controversial person. One controversial move. Oh. Well, one move is all it takes to get, you know, damned by everyone. Also, you want fucking OP, fucking Fraga and Lewis Hamilton run like one team. It's like, all right, do you? I, I guess no one has a chance of winning. Hey, look, I went the right way this time. On the, uh, on the split here. It's a miracle. Oh, shit. Forgot these turns are a little tight. <clears throat> I'm almost contemplating taking the supercharger off of this thing, because I'm kind of dominating these races. Like, easily. Thing in it wouldn't matter now since I already have you know there's only one race left and I'm gonna have like a five point lead heading into it. Oh, is that a run through the tunnel without touching anything? Oh shit! Maybe I'm just that good. Mayhaps. <clears throat> RS. I actually haven't any seen anything about the RX VGT. I haven't followed GT Sport news ever, because I'm a piece of shit. It's in my name, and yet I can't even follow the game. What the hell, man? Some fucking Rhino GT4 I am. Ween. Easy win. Don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall. Alright, sweet. It's not a numbered game. It's not actually GT7. You place first. Fake gamer playing the tire. <laughs> you, you got me. You got me. You're the tournament leader. Oh yeah. And another safe bonus, sweet. That's what I like to see. More money in my pocket. Congratulations! Part. You beat the track record. Ooh, the track record as well. Nice. Cool and good. What's that? I beat track record and not a 9/11. What is what is this shit? Oh, it's that thing. Okay. All right. So final race, Schwarzwald. I'm just gonna keep the supercharger attached. Doesn't matter at this point. Nice broken link, Lotus. You dead it. <clears throat> you dead it. Three, two, one, go! Alright, here we go. Get the Schwartz falling. <clears throat> oh, oh, hi, how you doing? How you doing? What's up, Paris? how Paris is still ahead of Dylan in the points, which means he's been consistently beating Dylan. That being said, Dylan just took second. Oh, oh, Paris is fighting back, though. They're having a tussle. 
Second place. Alright, I'm gonna try to, like, take this legit. Schwartz Father Ligma. Got him. Anyway, this car handles pretty well. Compared to all the other shits I've been driving, this car handles pretty well. <clears throat> Modern technology. <clears throat> Joseph Mama. I think it was front engine GT. <laughs> Judging by the engine sounds, depending on where the camera is pointed, I'd say it's front engine. Rock this place. Taking two different paths. So who's gonna get the advantage? It's Dylan. He got the advantage pretty easily, actually. It looks like. <clears throat> well, maybe not. They're right together, I think. According to the, uh, the leaderboard, they're together. How is that, Slop? I kind of I wanted Denny to win just because he's come up short so many times. <clears throat> I'm honestly surprised I'm driving this track this well. Considering. Very twisty and ha. Ah. <clears throat> oh. Lifted a little bit there over that crest. And across the line for another easy win and a clean sweep. Clean sweep. You place first! Get out the brooms, boys. It's sweeping time. Congratulations! You have won the tournament! Move on to the next tournament! I did it! I won the tournament! This looks kinda loud. Kinda fucking loud. Six best time. Okay. At least I'm finally on the leaderboard for this track. In this direction. Go away, cursor. Maybe a shot of my 944 at work. Luckily, it's something that's not such a close up. Or preferable, excuse me. Yeah, something like this. Sort of. Yeah, I can worry about that, whatever. That's fine. I can do some of that. But hey, there we go. We finished the 944 Cup. And now it's time to take on our final tournament of the Golden Era. For that. So, uh, onwards to 1988.